Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and we're I'm back with another Fake Grand Order video. I'm here with my brother, Nux. Hello. And we're here to continue on in our adventure to see if we can beat a single one of these challenge quests. A good question. We Basically, we got one run in us. I'm trying to get as many of these gold tickets as possible. We can basically, we have one try, we have one run in it, and the reason is because we do not, I do not have a lot of time to be recording. <laughs> I wanted to record all these. A little bit earlier, but work got too busy, and work is about to get pick up a little bit more um, coming up soon. So this is about the best I got. So next fight, we failed against Tota. Next is Leonidas. So if I click here, it'll tell us what... No, the support servants. Of course, my bad. Before we learn about the fight, we have to pick your support servant. My brother... He is, should be 80 here. Should be 80? Okay. We're going to go down here. Young Synchron. Yeah, he passed to 70. He's not here. All right, we're going to update. We're going to hashtag update the list. Hashtag feedmemore.com. Exactly, feedmemore.com. Uh, 80s? 80. Okay. Okay. The gay wind, there he is. Okay, we're here. Is this another choose between them? Yeah, I'm letting you choose. Okay, let's see. We have uh, more better units this time. Better units. We've got a Kentucky with a skull, <laughs> level ninety-two. We honestly might be <laughs> might be better than Gils de Reyes Maybe. with two hundred percent attack up. We got Gils de Reyes. Uh, he hits, grail. He hits pretty hard. Mm, sometimes, sometimes, and then we got Guy Win up in here in the mix. I'm going to go with Gils for the content. Flaming Man's special resist will be lowered each time a soldier is defeated. Be aware that Flaming Man will debuff an opponent who defeats a certain number of soldiers whenever his HP is broken. Flaming Man will buff soldiers each turn, so try to defeat him quickly before you're overpowered. Okay. So, we need to kill all of his adds? Yeah, basically that's what it sounded like to me. Alright, we're going to start from the start here. Um, you're first. Yeah, I think we're going to need, if I remember right, it looks like, I'm going to assume that there's going to be a lot of enemies and we need a buster support, and Himiko is literally going to be immune to all of them, so I'm going to go with my girl Himiko, and if that worst comes to worst, she can come in with slight punches at the end. Okay. That's who I'm picking. So we're going into here, we're going, I'm trying to think Leonidas, um, I would feel like... Would all of his infantry be the first three? First three classes of Saber, Archer, and Lancer? I would assume so. The Spartans were not known for very so much then, do we actually get Oberon here? We might be able to just use Oberon, to be honest. Wouldn't be a bad idea. And considering who we have... Of course, the best buster <laughs> at DPS we have. <laughs> here. All right, so then we're I'll go getting pretty costly with our two picks. It's, two. it's okay. I, I can go here because I think I can go. Here we go. We're going to be fighting a bunch of dudes. Who's... Why, why didn't you bring Gawain then? I, I brought in female Gawain. But doesn't the sun buff her? What do you mean? Gawain puts out the sun. That's true. But the difference is that your Gawain didn't have the 200% attack of. <laughs> yeah, he did. No, he didn't. He had the BB slots. The BB slots give zero attack. <laughs> and this is, of course, she's a she's the follow-up for when Gills fails. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So Next. then, other, we need another supporter. We need a tanky supporter. I'm trying to think here. Hmm. What does Karna do again? Santa? Uh, Karna Santa, he is a single target quick. And he is no, he's a pretty Does good DPS. Does he not DPS. give anything to anyone else? He doesn't. He can increase MP gauge and apply DBL immunity for a single ally. It's he can evade great. two times. And he can increase quick and buster card for himself. Hmm. No, I don't think that's what we're looking for. Okay. Hmm. I mean, I have my own Gawain. You do have your own Gawain, but I'm trying to think of someone supportive. There's not that many support. Maybe besides Dion. Who is just a debuffer, to be fair. Yeah, and a taunter. I really do like Dion. We can put Dion in. Oh, we can. It's your choice, though, on this one. The thing is, I, I don't think they're all Lancers. And we're going to yeah, have a bunch we're, of Sabres. We're, we're going to have a bunch of Sabres, so we might need to pick someone okay, else. Let's go with Archers. Okay. I know there's a clear Archer here that is support. And oh. uh, it's Nightingale. 
Santa. Oh, yeah, that's right. Nightingale Santa. Mine, of course, not buffed in any sort of way. Uh, and then mine... Let's see. Well, first of all, I pro it probably is Mash once more, just because... Just to save the cost? Yes, because once I imply this... Oh, it actually we're goes over, over. We're over encumbered. There we go. Se secrets we Company Assassin. We can give assassin. that to Nightingale, I think. And Ma Mash can get the guts. Fine. Okay. That works. All right. The sick team. Here we have Oberon, Himiko, and who are they supporting? Uh, Saber Gills. And uh, Vargas. Vargas. And that's basically it. <laughs> no one else. Can these dudes. Rapscallions. Rap scallions on hashtag uh, Team Darius H three. Toon Squad. Toon Squad. That's <laughs> what we're called. Can the Toon Squad handle the Monster Squad that we're about? The Spartan Squad. The Spartan Squad right now. Yeah, exactly. Let's go. And the first couple units is gonna answer that question for us. There is three hundred and one of these motherfuckers. <laughs> there is three hundred and one. Okay. Damn, that first guy, I kind of got hands, I'm not going to lie. That's the hero. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the hero. So, hmm. We have uh, two Himiko, one Gills, and two Oberon. That's, I think we can actually just start with a Himiko. Yeah. Because she can, uh, what? I think the Himiko is the way to go. Yes, and then... Uh, uh, put up Gills' buster. No, like, when we get to his cards, yeah, put that up. Yeah, the, these are all for on his turn. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll go in here. And yeah. We'll go, yeah. Start, start here. Start softening up uh, this single soldier. Because not a single one of our guys besides Oberon is AoE. Yes. And then he also makes them invincible after he's done. But he also makes them go to sleep. So it might all work out. I forgot that overcharges. It does overcharge. Gills is gonna... God damn! Gills is about to get a lot of uh, attack up. <laughs> he is. And minus defense. Charge formation? Okay, cool. Um, hmm. So I think we can go... Can we do this now? Because this does last five turns. Yeah. No, that lasts three turns. His buster lasts five turns. Five turns? Okay, so level five. This one lasts... But there, should we? Can we use this now? Then yeah, this is all is this all on a cooldown? It's on a cooldown on five. On a cool down on five. <laughs> so and this one no increases what. all eyes, and so we basically can only use this for when Oberon goes to do his stuff. Yes, that's cool. Um, I guess two gills, one Oberon. I mean, he's gonna kill the. So then Oberon, then two gills. Oh, we can do a quick chain then. Yeah. To get. We can. Because uh, I don't think we, I think we might if we're lucky and we crit, we might be able to kill the Spartan soldier. Yeah. Um. So with two, we, actually, with two, Gil, do we think Gills can do it? We have to believe in Gills. He has a Buster. I think I believe in Gills. I want to believe in Gills. And then Oberon. Sure. Yeah, buddy. I was gonna say that's a lot of attack he has right now. He should be able to do it. He should. Ow. 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 Okay, that's good. The okay. veteran. Veteran in the field. I forgot that Oberon might be have advantage over him, but that does not mean that he's uh, stronger than them. No. I can heal him a little bit. Okay, let's see. Um, it's a good Oberon. And mm. then there, there's a hundred percent on. I just realized this is complete. I should I should just use this regardless because this is just gonna buff everyone for by a little bit. This only bu in terms of the actual attack, this only buffs Oberon. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, hmm. I feel like we lead with Gills, go here, and then Oberon. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like he's going to be able to... Okay. If he had critted, he would have been able to kill him. If he him. got the first buster crit, that dude would have been dead. He would have been. He would have been 100% smoked. Yeah, that's right. No, Ow. don't do that. <laughs> yeah, you keep targeting him. It's very it's probably because he's the most... It's like least durable one yeah, that's true. an archer that's pretty bad <laughs> but we can't get a full bad. loop on gills and he might be able to kill i think he could kill with a full loop yeah he can kill with a full loop i think he can i i trust in him now there we go look at that boom 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 oberon i just need you to live for your guards pride oh no he's oh, not mp oh uh, it's fine he doesn't have an uh, offense base one. Oh yeah <laughs> it's fine. Honestly, who cares? Ambush formation. The only thing that sucks is that now we are forced to we target We have two them. grunts. 
but mm-hmm. we are forced to target him. We could Saint War older, but it's not gonna do anything. No, it's not. It just buffs him for the single turn, right? I think so. Hmm. We could switch out Oberon into maybe Night. No, not Nightingale. Uh, mm. Mash. I don't know. Actually. Mash. Let me see. Well, Nightingale maybe. Nightingale might be the answer, but the thing you have to remember is that this would put. A run all the way in the back. It would put all um, the way in the back. And right now I'm pretty happy. Actually, we might. Yeah, I might. I might do it. It might. It sounds very risky though. He's a bit in a volatile situation right now. He is. They really target him up front, crazy to in the first degree. But so if I do this, we can do a full mash loop, and she should be able to get her NP. Exactly. Do this so that they're forced to attack her. Do we want to give her the the defensive up for the single turn just to keep her alive? Uh, increases MP, but because I don't think that because unless they're doing a specific attack on us, I think we should be fine. I just realized how long does this last? One turn. Okay. So yes. Okay. I think there's method to this madness. Go here. Do a full loop. Uh, my reasoning is is that. Um, we should be able to... The, the only ones that are going to be actually able to do damage with MPs are the dudes here. And as long as we kill them before they can do that, we're fine. So we go here. We have to probably take down the archer. But at the same time, go we here, have like literally up. nothing to take down the archer. Maybe besides a lucky mash crit. <laughs> mm, okay, let's see. I think... Here, check on Gels' thing real quick. Okay, check him. Yeah, details. Oh, details. Gates for three turns. And his attack is for two. Okay, greatly increases attack two turns and greatly decreases defense for three turns. Yeah, but then he gets a lot of crits. Stars. He does. Are you saying you want to try setting him up for next turn? Probably. Okay, do we want to do it so... Because he Gil... doesn't have any cards on board, which means he's going to have cards on board next turn. Okay, do you want to go him first and then mash, or mash and then him? No, we need the defense more from mash. Okay. And then I'll go here just so she can actually get her stuff up as well. When she's at this part, she should be able oh. to. Yeah, the flag! I love that flag! I love being French. He does. Until he doesn't. Till he didn't. <laughs> Until he stopped. <laughs> Till they France. killed him for being too French. Our documentary for Gil's Array is coming soon. They the killed man him. The who was killed for being French. <laughs> Damn! Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, Himiko is really good. Damn, zero. No, 4,000 on a crit, though. Yeah, that's because he has defense down right now. And he's greatly, which is a lot. Okay, so... The thing is that his tactics are basically nothing. But yeah, okay. Trelile's encouragement. Do that. Then do this, because that'll give us some crit stars. Then... It's only for yourself. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'll save that for now. Um... We can do a full buster, I guess. We can go here, kill here, I think, potentially. It's, then a, go here. it's a guaranteed kill if he probably used the arts. Yeah, but if he hits this 50-50, then he can win. Yeah, he does kill here if he hits the 50. I see it. Go for it. Whoa, bam. Oh! <laughs> Let's go! 294 down, baby. Right now, shaking in his boots. Flaming man, more like almost dead. Charge formation. I'm wondering what part were we actually going to be able to hit him with some damage. Um, I think when he gets down his first thing, that's when he starts doing that. Alright, this will give... Okay, I'm just going to activate it. So. Go here, and then that should be... Assuming she crits, Damn. yes. Yeah. And then in comes him, slap. Got the crit. Got the crit. Well, that's the thing. Our, our team is actually funny enough super crit focused. It's very hey. crit focused. If you got you got Himiko giving crits and then on Gills' uh, arts, he can get crits a whole bunch. The only thing he needs is an MP upgrade to get rid of the defense <laughs> to pyramid. <determine. laughs> he does. Okay, so we can go here. I think we can go try and see what goes happens here and this try and get like back. All right. Minuscule or, 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 or Orion. Shh. He had the taunt on. It's fine. It's okay. Ow. Boo. Okay. Formation. Go here. Golden rule is up. Golden rule. I can use golden rule. 
I'll use that real quick. Get everyone. The NP. snowflakes are ready. Yes. I need to get the defense up because uh, I just realized there is an archer on the field, so. The quicker we can deal with them, the better. God damn, really? He hyper focused on him. Hmm. We can set up a Himiko Buster around. We can. Uh, do we want to protect him and make do it some Do we want to protect guild? Maybe. I, I, would, I would say so. I'm going to protect guilds. I'm going to go here, and then I'm going to try and do... I'm going to try and kill this fucker right here. And I'm going to go here for the, the ultra. And then this will overcharge guilds so that when he uses his... It will be a good attack up and a very bad defense down. <laughs> Huge defense down. He'll be basically good for a single attack for us. I forgot that Himika also gives crit. That's why those crits were doing such insane damage. Yeah. And also he has the 200. That too. That helps, for sure. Ow. Well, there goes potentially Mash. It's okay. She has her NP this turn. Mm-hmm. So we can go... But Gills does have... This is the... This is the gate they tell you about. Because you can protect a Mash, and you can use the NP next turn, or you could use Gills to his max potential. I mean, if I use his NP, I'll be able to yeah, attack. Yeah, he doesn't have very good crit chance right now, but still. You know what? I'm gonna believe in him. I'm gonna say that he's gonna take care of this guy for us right here. If he right can, here. then that's just how he does it. Right here, right now. That's how he's. That's why he's my friend. Go, Saint Orward. So much crit stores. So much crit stores. A lot of damage, to be fair. But he did still. do a lot of damage, but unfortunately, it was not enough in the end. Uh, but it's okay. They they're all raging not... misogynists, and they all decided to attack Mash instead for they some decided, reason. Decided no. Actually, no. We're not going to attack the dude. We uh, hate her in particular. Yeah, that's it's... a crit from Himika. I'm, I, at this point, we're just going to see how much damage we can do to Flaming Man. I think this is uh, unfortunate. Uh, we are not going to be... Flaming not used his MP, though. Not yet. Um, I wonder how much you need to go down, because we're, we're like at 290-something, I think. 291. Oh, actually. Whoa! He does a lot of damage. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Damn! That one buster does good enough, but let's see. He might be... Ooh, they went for Himiko. That's not um, the greatest. Ooh, that means we live for a singular turn. Does he still have the buff on him? Uh, it's for two turns for the attack. Go up. S uh. It's still up. Mm, so if I use this, this will increase uh, special Her offense. buster, and they could do big buster. And this will give it invincibility as well, so that'll be good. What I'm basically saying is, can we kill him? I think we can kill him. We're gonna go. We're gonna go for the single. Okay. Aren't gonna... you gonna start from the front and then go all the way down? I cannot because he has taunt. Oh, he has taunt now. Yeah. Okay, never mind. So we're, this is just how it's gonna be. So can you get the crit? Nope. But he came close. Yeah, pretty close. That's a down. Let's see what happens here. Probably a lot of nothing good. Can they give all the charge? Himiko, take it all. Take it like champ. No, man. No! Kills. Sad. So sad. My hero. It's gonna. Ha it's up to Bargist. It's up to Bark. And uh, a slowly dying Himiko. Can you? He this gives a buff buff to anyone, right? Apply yeah. guts and increase. One alley. Easy. All right. This will stop. Remove and restores all. Oh, this will get rid of. Yeah, they get rid of the taunt. That's good. Uh, increases attack and crit strength for all allies. Support. She is very good. It's a, we have a very crit oriented team. <laughs> we do. Is there something? No, there's not. Okay, I'm gonna strong go here. Eater. Yeah, she's hashtag strong. Are you gonna try and go all in? On him or for on these? I was gonna say you can go all the way down and get one hit on him with Bargus. I can. I can. The thing is, is that I can go Barg here, and then the other two try and clean up the soldier. That's the one thing is that I, I need. We need to get rid of that archer. Well, there she goes. Too bad we already used all our skills. Damn. Damn. Okay. 
Not bad. We there's a. Ch- I'm not saying that we're there's doing a it. Chance. There is a chance we he might kill. He left Himiko alive. That's crazy. All right, though that means we got a chance here. And both of these are. Oh yeah, they're sealed because of everything. But it's okay because we already used it. We already used all of them. When I can use this. Actually, no. After she triggers the guts, I can use it to heal her up a little bit more. We can go here. Chemical. Okay. Do we keep focus? trying to fight the flaming? Do we want to wait till we have a good attack on the flaming man? The thing is, you can. Uh, yeah, probably. Yeah, after we get our crits up a little bit, then we'll go we, for we flaming man. Vargas should still have all of her stuff up. Yeah, it's times like this I wish I had actually invested in making uh, Nightingale Archer a little bit strong. Santa, Santa Nightingale, just a little bit stronger. Damn! Damn! Big punch. Rear guard pride. Oh, he's wasting his turn. Don't talk about your rear. <laughs> My Saiyan rear. <laughs> now he's Vegeta. No. Oh shit. That's okay. But over on we head. have the chance to do the funniest thing before Vargas dies. <laughs> we could do. The thing is, his skills are not. They are not. Um, she let me still see. has the guts for for one turn. a single turn. Okay, so that. Do we want to throw in a single arts just to get the potential NP up, or do we want to go all Buster? Maybe to get the NP up. She has no stars, so we probably need the NP more than okay. anything. And to be fair, it is an AoE. Until she removes his buffs. She does. And then he gets rid of his defense. For the first time ever, my level 100-something Vargas is actually getting use outside Temple of... still alive! <laughs> no! I, this is ridiculous. Heal. Um, I guess we I do think, pull him go. I think we're. I think we go for Flaming Man, right? Yeah. I think we're done trying to fight the others, because if we get an archer thrown into the mix, we're kind of fucked. Yeah. But if we get a bunch of crit stars in, and Oberon can live, she she refused to die until the end. That was pretty strong. It was very we strong. We have enough. We have enough. Do it you will think? Be one. Exactly one. We don't have another turn. You don't think we have another turn? But no, they both have guts. Okay. We can try it. I'm just saying. Well, do we want to save it for next turn? These soldiers are getting pretty strong. But the, the guts will trigger and then it will... Okay. The thing is, is that if we go for this... Yeah. That effectively kills bar actually you know what do we go for it we have two busters on loop that's why i'm trying to say maybe there is a chance we brute force this i'm so scared because i think we can actually beat this but the thing is is that i don't know if we're going to be able to survive another attack i think should we go all in on vargas we either go all in or we do here and then what we do is that we get the Morning Lark, and we she doesn't get to do her NP, but she does get to hit everyone. And that will reduce her skill cooldowns, and that will make us be able to hit more. That's true. But it should be able to kill these dudes, I think. It should. All right, we're going to so go we for won't, we won't do the big buster thing just yet. No, but we'll see if this would have potentially killed. I feel like it would, but we'll see. Yeah, we'll maybe see. Maybe she was 200. Um, that's why I'm going with arts as well, because with 100% arts, maybe we'll get a little bit lucky. I forgot that she also increases her buff turn. We'll see. Heals. She does heal from this. That's the other reason why I wanted to do it. They're dead. Okay. I think we would have been... I forget that she gets defense down. It would have been close, but I think we would have just barely missed out. Yeah. Let's see what they summon in next. Oberon. Thank God he's so goddamn weak. So the thing is, Oberon is going to get his NP this turn. Yes, yeah, so we can use that to make them go to sleep. And potentially kill the archers. Yes. So, attack a bit with Oberon first, and then do his NP. So or go- you can do Bargus Oberon on Flaming Man, and lie, lie like a Vortigern. So go here, here, and then lie, lie like Vortigern, and then we're good for the turn, right? I think so. Okay. Oh, we're so close. I almost feel like we should have used it on Oberon the Sea. Oh. But we'll go here. <laughs> it's 
spoilers. It is spoilers, but you already <laughs> had him that way. He's asleep and invincible. The his ads won't be asleep, which is the sad thing. I just realized that if Vargas had been um hmm. if she had had the ability to remove the debuff, she would have been able to remove it, wouldn't she have? Yeah, but these are permanent. Okay. Damn, I just realized that's not going to be enough. Does she still have her guts? She still does have her guts. So Do we, we try and get the quick up for next turn then? Maybe. So go here, here, here. Yeah. I mean, Oberon is dead no matter what. But you use that on her, she's dead. I know, that's what I'm saying. I almost feel like just using it on him. To target him down? Oh, you could. No, there's no point. Uh, he at least, uh, as it does now, there's a chance that they all in on Vargas. Uh, there's a chance. She's a chain Frieza. Okay, he's gonna do this. Unfortunately, this also increases everything from him. It does. It's one for Vargas. It's two for Vargas. <gasps> it's two for Vargas. They didn't kill Vargas. They did not kill Vargas. Okay. Do you? Go here, obviously. Strong, Strong eater. eater. We don't have any I think, of that up. I think we just used the command seal, right? I think so. He's one ally, so MP by 100. He still has a defense up, so I don't know if it'll work. Doesn't this remove it? Uh, yeah, I think so. Doesn't Vargas currently have the thing that removes buffs, is what I'm asking. Strong eater restores HP for some normal to remove one buff. So we have to attack normally with Vargas first. Yes. So, or do we do it twice? Because he has multiple buffs, right? He has... Well, there's a chance we take away his crit, his taunt, or his defense. So we have to attack first with the arts. We have to hope his taunt, or... No, not his taunt. His defense goes away. If we miss this, then we basically lose. We do. How much is this defense up? Is it just... I don't know. We could check over here. <laughs> we can. I think no, though. I think with us so close. Ah, uh, man. Okay. I think we're going to go for it. We're going to go all in? We're going to go all in. Okay. Either this wins or this loses. So we have to go arts. Do we want to go buster? The only reason I ask is because the MP also increases buster. So it would make sense to NP first and then use Buster. Yeah, probably. But if, <laughs> and then hope that we get some lucky crits. Yeah. Okay, I think... And that her extra attack... Oh, we just have to really hope that this first one hits the... Um... The defense. Yes. Let's see. No, Damn it! The crit. But it did lower the defense by a little bit. That's good. Maybe that'll equal it out. Let's find out. Smash... Smash! Die! Yes! <laughs> kill. There we go. Do we have to kill all 281 now? Oh, God. Sleep, Bardigus. Sleep, my beautiful, gigantic woman. <laughs> Sleep. Sleep. I can't believe we won that. I'm going to be 100% real <laughs> that that fight. It turned out the Himiko and the Gills uh, Saber. The stall that the, we did. Yeah, that weird stall team we had actually ended up working. This is why Fogo is fun sometimes with challenge quests. It's like it's not you put, it's putting the, the strongest units imaginable with the weirdest fucking units imaginable and seeing what happens. Yes. Okay. That is one. So if anyone out there who said, I'm going to guess you're not going to be able to beat anyone, you we just lost. We did it this. We just did it this We episode. just, boom, boom. You just lost. Boom. You're done. Now, anyone who says one or, <laughs> anyone who said one, we can't win any single other one for you to be able to be considered that we've beaten it. But that's the end of this video, everyone. Thank you very much for watching. We'll be back with another one. You probably will be on the same day. I don't know. I have to release a lot of these videos in quick succession. Yes. So... Till next time, say goodbye, boy. Goodbye. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.